Good morning, everyone. Hi, Monique says hello. And I'm gonna put him down now. He just wanted to say hi. Today we're gonna be reading a story called Bananas Sometimes. Where's Monique? Oh, he's not, there he is. Oh, I keep, there he is. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> Bananas Sometimes is about building our imagination and envisioning everyday objects just like bananas and seeing what they kind of look like. So let's get started. <clears throat> Let me log in. I'm gonna use a smile. Bananas Sometimes. Bananas Sometimes, written by Elizabeth Strauss or Strauss. Bananas sometimes look like hands. And I'm gonna actually talk about a strategy. If I were to be reading this book for the very first time, and because it's a level B book, there's gonna be some tricky words in there. So I'm gonna be practicing my strategy that's called get your mouth ready, okay? So if it starts with an H, I'm gonna get my mouth ready to make the H sound like. So let's look at this one. Bananas sometimes look like, ooh, that's tricky. And I'm looking at the picture. Oh, I know, maybe hands. Does that make sense? Bananas sometimes look like hands. Yeah. So let me show you my strategy. And I'm gonna show you kind of what it looks like to use it. So this is getting your mouth ready. I saw that it started with a H. So I was like, my mouth was getting ready. Hands. Okay, so let's do another one. Bananas sometimes look like, ooh, tricky word. It starts with a B. The B says, this looks like a, Say it with me if you already know what it is. Bananas sometimes look like boats. Good. The next one, bananas sometimes look like, what is he holding? Like a, getting my mouth ready, pencil. Bananas sometimes look like pencils. Yes, that makes sense. It kind of looks like a pencil. Ooh, bananas sometimes look like what is this? Spiders. Bananas sometimes look like spiders. Yeah, if you put them together like that, they kind of look like spiders. Bananas sometimes look like t -t -t -t. hmm. This one might be really tricky because we don't usually call them this anymore. We just say phone or iPhone, but in this case, it starts with a t t t. What is it? A t t t telephone. It's a telephone. Bananas sometimes look like telephones. Ooh, this one's funny. Bananas sometimes look like. Get my mouth ready with that s sound. The s says smiles. Bananas sometimes look like smiles. And I'll put a smiley face there. Oh, this is a new word. Bananas sometimes look like getting my mouth ready with that F sound. Fr frowns. Frown is when you are not smiling, but your smile is upside down. It's a frown. Bananas 
always look good to eat. They definitely always look good to eat. I ate a banana today. Okay, so for your assignment today, I want you to tell me what a banana reminds you of, okay? So look around your house and see what a banana can look like. Um, you can also use some of the examples from the book. So if you wanna use telephone or pencil, you can totally do that. I just want you to write the sentence that says, bananas, bananas, sometimes look like blank. And like I said, you can find something different in your house that you want to use that looks like a banana, or you can use some of the examples from the book. So just a reminder, here are the ones that we found in the book. Frowns, smiles, telephones, spiders, pencils, boats, and hands. Okay, so have fun, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.